name because it's a pneumatic instrument. There are three big compressors and uh, the wind that is produced by these compressors go through tubes into cushions that are inflatable. And then from these inflatable cushions you have again tubes to different instruments. And so the audience is invited to come and sit down on the cushions. But by doing so they change the air pressure. And by changing the air pressure the sounds of the sculptures change themselves too. And that's the biggest one that we have uh, made there are for the moment uh, 20 sculptures of these and they take like uh, 200 or 300 uh, square meter to do the setup. On the idea behind it is actually that it's the technology of an organ, a traditional church organ, but upside down. We don't play the instrument with any sort of keys, since what we do is we change the air pressure in order to make the pipes, which are all the different instruments, make very different things. We've done performances with an uh, organ and uh, pneumophones together. To and the, the contrast between the two is great because the organist is sitting very stiff and silent. And he's playing and he hardly moves, just his hands. And then you see the people that are playing the pneumophones rolling and going over and back on these cushions. So this contrast like, between the past and the future is uh, <laughs> one of the things we use a lot in our works.